Okay. You deny or say yes or no. Right. I mean, because it doesn't help you either way. But... Shirts off, pants down. Welcome to Kenny KO, where you are guaranteed to be triggered. Today's subject is on none other than the notorious Michael Hearn, or Michael Trend, more commonly known as. I mean, it's been quite some time since we have done the Michael Trend videos. The very next day, I always somehow receive a copy strike. No. Seriously? He just said that? I'm gonna copy strike this guy. Just for that word. And it's sent from, you guessed it, Michael Hearn himself. Today I really wanted to discuss why, in my opinion, I believe Michael Hearn is one of the most fakes in the fitness YouTube community, and really break down everything he's done throughout his entire career to what makes him get that title. First, I want to bring to light some old information on Michael Hearn. Many of you probably already know this if you follow Mike's journey. He used to sell duck eggs. <laughs> for a whopping $700 USD, $700 Like at, at that point, those duck eggs better have the most anabolics, the best purity I have ever seen. He became so notorious for selling those duck eggs that he even made a phone app game for it. <laughs> like, I gotta I got respect this man as an entrepreneur. He knows how to turn every single situation in his favor from a business standpoint. Now the timing of the Michael Trent video couldn't be better because with Michael Hearn's duck egg scam, it is also the same time that the world record egg has just received the most likes in Instagram history for a single photo. Getting a whopping 38,485,823 likes at this current moment. To me, that just seems like one of Michael Hearn's $700 eggs got loose. But you are about to witness what Michael Trend has taken his new entrepreneur skills to, and that is being what everyone is now these days, a professional motivational speaker. Let's get to it. What I love is one of those things that through social media, you go, ah, you can't do this, you can't do that. Uh, yeah, 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 sorry to tell you, but you can. I'm sorry guys to pause the video so rapid there, but there are a few things I have to just get out and vent off my chest. Number one, I don't know if this was intentional, but Mike posts this motivational video, and of course at the top of the screen is hashtag natural subs. I don't know if he's trolling the ultimate troll, but then number two, Mike, my man, you, you just need to slow down on the Botox, okay? Just slow it down, you know, creep down the amount you're doing maybe a little bit, because I don't want to see you turn into this. Oh gosh. And then this part right here, yeah, it does not get any better than this. Maybe they are actually doing a round of applause, a standing ovation for Mike Tren for his motivational speaking, and how much deep down he truly touched these certain individuals. But I just can't help it, with Mike O'Hearn's past, I have a feeling that on a teleprompter, like if you go on some TV show, they have round of applause. Boo! Like where they instruct the crowd what to do. I have this like, Super strong gut feeling that they had standing ovation posted somewhere to where everyone simultaneously started to stand up and give a round of applause to the best motivational speaker of all time. I mean, most people have already seen the interviews and the video clips on YouTube of him defending his natural status like no one's business. In case you didn't, let's go ahead and roll one. Oh, I started at eight. Yeah, the foundation was, you don't gotta convince me on the whole thing. No, 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 but I'm gonna ask you questions. Okay. You deny or say yes or no. Right. I mean, cause it, it doesn't no, help you, you either you, way, but... You but, were already developed when I first saw so you, so... before puberty, I had something. I was 176. A uh, year and a half later, I was 272. I was already benching over 400 pounds by the time I was 15. Yep. Um, squatting 550 pounds. So, 16, 17, I'm about 272. I'm right now 260. So I'm actually 12 pounds lighter than I was when I was 15. And yes, Mike, we all know what you looked like when you first started training. Denied because this totally validates that you are indeed natural. I've never been able to comprehend how someone thinks they can defend their natural status by saying, I looked this certain way when I was six and eight years old. That logic makes zero sense. Just look at little Hercules or whatever his name was back in YouTube's history. He was the most jacked little young kid of all time. And then nowadays he looks below average. That argument holds no ground at all. When scrolling through Michael Hearn's Instagram, I happen to see that it looks like he has a kid on the way, a young Titan. And all jokes aside, like honestly, huge 
huge congrats, Mike. I mean, I know that's a huge step. It's a huge thing. It's something you've probably wanted for a long time, I probably assume. I mean, I'll just go ahead and say it. The fitness industry would be so extremely boring if it did not have Mike O'Trend. I can probably guess what Michael Hearn's kid is probably gonna look like. And that's only at like two years old. You can also head over to Michael Hearn's website where you can see his fit plan among many other things and products he sells. But what really caught my eye was his fitness plan because he has listed professional secrets and strength gains. Under professional secrets, I expect Michael Hearn to finally reveal what dosages, what he's taking, what he's cycling, for how long. Because I mean, I'm not gonna lie, like no homo, Michael Hearn is one hell of an attractive dude. And there's probably not one keyboard warrior here who can disagree with that statement. Mike is a true champion, well-rounded athlete who has graced over 500 fitness covers, second to Arnold Schwarzenegger. This part right here, guys, Michael Hearn has graced grace like graceful i just love the word choice that they chose for writing this article graced he graced 500 articles but he's like that classic guy that portrays himself as being a superhero saying he, like once again that he graced the earth with his presence and his magnificent aesthetic body winning the four-time natural mr universe just out of curiosity i want to see what reviews people put from michael hearn and his program join the titan crew Honestly, is one of the best strength programs I've ever done. The size and strength gains I got were unbelievable. John Bass, Professional Secrets. The typing sounded a little bit scripted to me. Firstly, because no one on the internet in the history of doing reviews for any product types an actual well-formed sentence with commas, periods, and everything going along with it. And then on top of that, that is the only review on the whole plan. It was probably written by Mike himself and put on his own product page. And it's just so generic. Honestly, it was one of the best strength programs I have ever done. The size and strength gains I got were unbelievable. Like, to like totally believable, you know? As soon as you buy Mike O'Hearn's workout fit plan, you're gonna go to his website, type in a review. It was the best strength gains and size I've ever gotten. Graced. Honestly though, we love Michael Hearn on this channel. Like I mentioned, the fitness industry would be so incredibly boring without him in it. I'm not even trolling when I say that. I believe like the whole natural or not debate among many other athletes was simply brought up because of Michael Hearn and how long he has been in the industry. And I'm not discrediting Mike at all. I know he's accomplished a lot through his career. Like I said, he turns every situation into a business profit and he looks incredible for being how old he is. So it's all just fun on the channel. We're just giving Mike some constructive criticism to not write his own reviews for his fitness plan to, you know, of course he stopped selling the $700 duck A's. In the back of my mind, Mike, if you are watching this video, and I hope you are, please leave in the comments down below if anyone actually bought the $700 duck eggs because I'm actually super curious if anyone went out of their way to buy $700 for duck eggs. And then of course, how your photo became the most liked photo on Instagram's history. Once again, congratulations on the pregnancy. I hope nothing but the best. I already know the kid's probably gonna be the most insane lifter of all time. I already know that kid's gonna be squatting like 600 pounds by the time he's six years old. That wraps up the video for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to give the video a thumbs up. If you are new to the channel, I welcome you. Please make sure to subscribe. And on that note, I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.